In this video, you'll learn how to use the Xero dashboard to get an overview of your business. When you log into Xero, the first thing you'll see is the dashboard. It provides you with useful information about your bank balances and organisation financials. Let's take a closer look at each panel. Use the bank account panel to monitor your bank balance and to reconcile the bank transactions. Click the menu icon to see what else you can do with the bank accounts. Hover over a dot on the graph to see the balance on that date. The next panel shows the cash moving in and out of your organisation, based on figures in the bank summary report. Hover over a bar to see the breakdown for that month. Or click on a bar to see the bank summary report for that month, to see more details. Let's move to the next panel, the account watch list. This displays accounts that you've chosen to monitor on the dashboard. To add more accounts to this list, go to the chart of accounts. Then, edit an account and enable the option to show on dashboard watch list. The watch list shows two balances. The first column shows the balance posted to the account during the current month. The second column shows the balance posted to the accounts for the financial year, to the end of the current month. Now let's take a look at the sales and purchase panels. This panel shows you a summary of the invoices owing to you and how long they've been owed based on the due dates of the sales invoices that you've sent to your customers. Hover over a bar to see the outstanding amounts for that period or click on the bar to go to the sales overview and see more details. The next panel shows you a snapshot of the bills you need to pay and when you need to pay them. It helps you to identify your future commitments which allows you to keep on top of your cash flow. Once again, hover over a bar to get a summary for the period. Or click on the bar to go to the purchase overview and see more details. Finally, customise the dashboard layout to view your financials the way you want to. At the bottom of the screen, click Edit Dashboard. To move a panel, click on the panel and drag it to the new position. Click Hide or Show to remove or add a panel back to your dashboard. Then save the changes. Thank you.